it is only God. I say it is only God who has all power and authority. And I tell leaders, please, it is an honor to be in a place of leadership. It is an honor from God. Amen? And I say that it is God who entrusts people with leadership. But when you lead, knowing it is God who entrusted you, you lead with humility. Knowing that it is at his disposal. I wish that everybody, including our politicians, can know it is not dependent on them. It is dependent on God. Sometimes when you see them out there with the competitions they do, you know, sometimes you wonder, where are they putting God in all these mathematics? And you know, these things are subject to God. It is only God who is eternal. It is only God who is all-knowing. And that's why I told you the other day, don't waste time about thinking about 2022. It is still distance. And the determination about 2022 is not a decision of humanity. It's a decision of heaven. Because the last time I read the Bible, it says, God raises kings. Amen? So stop fighting your neighbors about tomorrow. Because tomorrow is in the hand of God. I said tomorrow is in the hand of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. 